What the fuck was that? Why the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, guys. All right. I'm Fly Guy DC Cardini. I drop on my radio show. Of you enjoy the man. Yo, what's up? It's your girl Cardi B. I'm with Fly Guy DC, and you're listening to Up by Cardi B. Did you get that motherfucker? Did you get that motherfucker? Okay. All right. So, uh, hi everybody. Yo, look how life is, right? Remember when I used to go on live all the time? I stopped going on live because I get really fucking bad anxiety. I've been having really bad anxiety this whole entire week. Yesterday, when I put out the song, I had, I was like relief of anxiety. And I fell asleep like at 3 a.m. And I woke up at 8 a.m. Just having my anxiety and just <laughs> making sure everything's straight and all of that bullshit. Uh, but you know, I'm happy, I'm content. And I want to say thank you, everybody that enjoyed. <clears throat> thank you, everybody that enjoyed my music video thank you everybody they enjoyed the song thank you everybody they have shown me support all the fans uh every artist every influencer uh they reposted my video every artist every influencer and definitely my fans like yo yeah y'all the best like y'all the best like i love y'all motherfuckers so much i want to give you all a part of my body but i can't <laughs> Uh, she's coming. Hello? Oh. Hello? Oh, my bad. Well, I'm saying hello. You see, I'm losing my mind. A bitch is motherfucking crazy. I'm losing it, y'all. I'm losing it. A bitch is crazy. A bitch is motherfucking crazy. All right? So, oh. Uh, all right. So, yeah. I just want to say thank you, guys. Thank you, everybody. Thank you to my team. I'm going to be doing a Q&A tomorrow. I think it's... Is it tomorrow, Robbie? A Q&A on Twitter? I need to check. When am I... I'm, well, I'm doing a Q&A on Twitter really motherfucking soon. But I'm just going to give you a little brief of everything. Just a little brief of everything and whatever. And I'm just going to address a couple of things that have been going on online. Usually, a lot of things bother, a lot of things bother me when people be trying me. But I'm not really bothered at this shit because it's just like... People are just gonna say shit and what whatever. So I already seen not only one artist, I seen like fucking four already. Like, oh Cardi copy my B. Cardi copy my 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 if it's up then it's stuck. If it's up then it's stuck. And it's like, let me tell you something, right? If I was to jack somebody's shit, I'm the type of person that I don't like going to court. A bitch been go I've been going, I have like fucking five lawsuits and shit. I don't like going to court. If I jack something from somebody and I could give a nigga $20,000 and 2% of a song, I'm going to do that because that takes less time and less money than going to court and possibly losing. But the thing is that I never heard of you niggas. I never heard your motherfucking song. And let me just show you something, right? So hold on. Hold on. How I add pictures with this new fucking phone? I don't know how to fucking add. I can't fucking add the pictures on this motherfucking phone. <sighs> How do I add it? Okay, so yeah, so um, official Kim Barbie posted on his blog like fucking four different songs, and there has been six different songs with the same shit. And it's like, all right, so that means I copied twelve motherfuckers with the same type of. If it's up, then it's stuck. If it's up, then it's stuck. Yeah, come on, now, my nigga, just chill. I did the song around August. Um, I did it, I did it while I was do uh, while the whole WAP thing was getting set up. That's why when y'all see the live on Megan, I'm like, if it's up, then it's stuck. If it's up, then it's stuck, bitch. Because I was working on that song. That's how long I've been having it under my pockets and under my titty. And look, I just want to show y'all similarities 
of like different songs. Hold on. Let me make sure I press right. Make sure I press right. Oh shit! Wait, hold on. I'm trying to look for it. Damn, I lost it. I don't know where it's at. I don't know where I can't find it because, damn, I took a lot of screenshots and I don't want to fucking screenshot the wrong shit. But if you go to Ken Barbie Official, Ken Barbie Official, you will see four different people with the same shit. If it's up, then it's stuck. If it's up, then it's up, then it's up, then it's stuck. It's just like four songs. Future has something similar to it. And I didn't even motherfucking know. So it's just like, um, if y'all niggas feeling a certain type of way, y'all could go to court. We could take it to court. I don't give a fuck. But I know a bitch like me. I don't know you motherfuckers. Um, so many people have been coming out and I'm like, well, so that means I, 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 I copy, I copy the same shit from eight different songs, nigga. Get the fuck out of here. It's something simple. If somebody was to say like, oh, you copy the hook from WAP, more or less. But if it's up, then it's stuck. Really, nigga? Get the fuck out of here. What I didn't like was one nigga that was threatening me and shit. I don't take threats lightly. Like, it's like everybody else, if you feel a certain type of way, I could understand, even though I don't fucking know you. But when a nigga threats me, threat me, my nigga, you could suck dick with no knee pads. Fuck you think this is? I ain't pussy. You, just because I'm a bitch, no I mean you're going to be threatening me. I don't give a fuck. A bitch ain't never been pussy. I don't know who the fuck you talking to. You got me fucked up. Like, talking about, yup, it's up. Nigga. Get the fuck out of here. More or less. Anyways. And then there has been three people, right? With the same beat. Some people are like, oh, this is my beat. This was my beat. Blah, blah, blah. So, here, I'm going to let y'all know this, right? I'm going to let y'all know this, right? All right? You hear me? Motherfuckers send me and my fucking engineer folders of beats. Like, a, a fucking producer might send me a hundred, a hundred motherfucking beats. And shit, like a hundred beats and shit in one folder, right? If I like a if I like a beat and I want to use it, I use it. Now, when we use it, we hit up the producers. I want to let y'all know how this shit works. When we we hit up the producers, like, yo, have anybody bought this beat? Have any artists used this beat? Is this beat available? If they say yes, they say yes. Like it's like I'm just buying the beat. I'm not a producer and I'm not in the fucking shit doing the beat with them. And on top of that, a lot of these producers put the beats that they that artists haven't bought yet. They put it on YouTube all the time. That's how fucking Whoopty and um and King Vaughn, they have the same beat. A lot of producers put the shit on motherfucking YouTube. I didn't got it from YouTube. Niggas motherfucking send me that shit. So it's like, if you have a problem because my beat is similar to yours, you need to take that off with the producer that send it to Barty. I, 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 you got it? And on top of that, a girl that's claiming that I took her beat, the producer sent me a cease and desist that he sent her like nine months ago. Way before I even motherfucking did the song. So, uh, shorty, you posting all that, but why you ain't posting that? So, um, yeah, that's not my fault. I'm not a producer, all right? And that shit happened all the time. Like, for example, one of my favorite songs that I was going to put on Invasion of, of Privacy called Automatic had the same. I was going to put it out, right? And then one week later, I saw that Bad Baby had the beat. And I was like, yo, what the fuck? And I was so mad, but it's like, it is what it is. That's what happens when producers send their beats. To different people. The fuck? What, you gonna be mad at me and shit? Uh, 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 uh. Bitch, don't take that up with me, bitch. Take it up with them. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. That's one of... One of the things that I wanted to address. It's not a big deal. I just hate when people do certain shit like that. Because I'm a business bitch at the end of the day. And if I feel... Like, for example, you know how Bodak... Kodak uh, uh, had the same thing. I gave him a percentage of my song on my song because that's how business is. And it's like, yeah, it's true. Like, it's the same cadence and everything. But when I don't know your fucking song and I never heard of your shit and you want to jack something, nah. I, you, I'm not giving you shit. I'm going I'm to give you.
So, um, is that sweetie on this now? But you know what? Now that I fucking think about it, it's like, how the fuck I didn't, why did I, I didn't think of me putting her saying that? I should have fucking think. But you know what? I was just rushing so many in January because I had to do something in January, but <laughs> that's why I put it out around February. I know I had to put out a single soon, like around November. And this is one of the songs that I like had like super complete. I had one verse. My songs have like one verse. Probably don't have no hook. I had WAP for a year and I didn't have no hook like until the end. Like I was like, I don't know. I don't know what to do with this hook. So I um, had this motherfucking song for a long time. And I just felt like this song is one of my completed ones. Because like I said, I have a lot of incomplete songs. And I'm like, I, it just feels good. Um... I call, I call, um, I got, um, this director all the way from, uh, the Ukraine. And, uh, you know, I told him my ideas that I have for the music video and everything, how I want it. And then the whole December, uh, when we started, like December, the second week of December, or the first week of December.